paper and paper products. We all use them every day, but what are the effects? Many people don't think about the aftermath of making and using paper products. If the U.S. cut down paper usage by 10%, it would prevent the emissions of 1.6 million tons of greenhouse gases, the equivalence of taking 280,000 cars off the road. There are 30 million trees cut down per year in Australia alone. Many animals also become homeless in this process. 1.5 tons of greenhouse gases are emitted for every ton of paper used. With this, the paper industry ranks fourth in the contribution of greenhouse gases. If all the wasted paper in the world were to be combined, a wall 12 feet tall could be built stretching from California to New York. Only about 3% of students in school recycle paper. So just how much paper do we use? This graph shows the usage of paper per person in the year 2006. Now that we know the effects, what can we do about it? One great way to reduce paper use is by lowering or eliminating the use of certain paper products. Some of these products would include paper plates, paper towels in the kitchen, and of course paper napkins. Try replacing these items with those that can be washed and reused. Try to eliminate the waste of sheets of paper. Print or write on both sides if necessary and use scraps as post-it notes. Say no to paper and plastic. Choose to use canvas grocery bags when shopping. And last but not least, please remember to recycle. Mm -hmm.